Yep. So we're here at the Cattle Parish Confederate Monument. Let's read what it says. It says, the Cattle Parish Confederate Monument has been placed on the National Register of Historic Places by the United States Department of the Interior, January 29th, 2014. 2014, guess who was president? President Obama. Keep that in mind. So it says the last Confederate flag. The first courthouse on this site was the Confederate capital of Louisiana and headquarters of the Trans-Mississippi Department Confederate States of America from 1863 until May 26, 1865. When the last Confederate flag was lowered, Major General Henry W. Allen was inaugurated here and served here as governor. So last one, the 46th Confederate Veterans Reunion, June 9th, through, June 9th through the 12th, 1936. This block has been here since 1936. It says, Louisiana and Shreveport's tribute of honor and respect, memorializing the deeds and valor of the men who so gallantly, nobly, and conscientiously defended the cause of 1861 to 1865. You see this monument? See that monument? This monument is to these men. Let's see, let's see what are their names. It says M E General R. E. Lee. Oh, Robert E. Lee, of course. Robert E. Lee. Uh who is this? Something Allen, Confederate States of America, Governor. Who's this on this side? We got General Beauregard. And this last person, Jackson, General Stonewall Jackson of the Confederate States of America. That says something to you, that we're right here in front of the first JDC, the first judicial district of Louisiana, and we have this monument. This says something to us. This is a monument to murderers who honor and respect from Louisiana and Shreveport. Men who gallantly, nobly, and conscientiously, that's an important word, conscientiously defended the cause of 1861 to 1865. This should tell us everything that we need to know. You know what? Keep this monument here. Keep this monument here. In fact, I want them to talk about all the black people that they killed, all the black people that they maimed, that they raped, the babies, the children, the little girls, the little boys that they brutalized, that they raped, all these things that we say we have an issue with today in America, guess what? These men, these men are being honored for that. They're being honored for that. So now when we see a lot of the ills in America, look at what we celebrate. Look what we have monuments to. Don't tear the monument down. Tell the real history about it. These men were traitors. They committed treason. And they, they, they were rebels. And everybody who re represents that flag and, and supports that flag is a traitor and treason to the democracy of America.